I was walking up on York Street, avoiding all eyes, glaring at feet. When I saw this man lounging on Cool Lane, I knew his life, or maybe I just knew his pain. The neon lights were weathered, and so was he. Sketching portraits, maybe one of me. Punched in the downpour, no complaints. Stopping the rain from getting into his paints. Yeah. No, you're not alone. We are the same. I know your pain. No, you're not alone. We are the same. I know your pain. So I pulled my hood down and I tell him. That's real good, man. Could be the next big thing. He looks startled, but he gives a grin and says, "I just like painting. They don't really care who's watching." In his pocket, there was a mirror. The edges were black and burned. I suppose him and I both still have many lessons we've yet to learn. No, you're not alone. The loneliness stalks those who behold great skies. I read that in a book, mate. I think I know why it's come to mind. This man, his eyes sunken and glazed, hands worn down into a wrinkled old maze. There's something in his heart that's smiling so loudly. Maybe he works down at the tills in Aldi because I recognise this man. Honestly, I do. Come to think of it. I recognise a few people here. That man opposite, smoking by the cafe, was working out beside me down Pure Gym the other day. And the busker by the roadworks who's singing old blues, she certainly walked a fair few miles in my shoes. Strangers are just as strange as I allow them to be. And I look around giddily, and I'm starting to see that here on Cool Lane, of all places. Such a beauty in people's faces. So now I'm walking back down York Street. This time I'm holding all eyes and I greet as I meet so many people lounging on lanes. I know their lives and I know their pains. The lights are still weathered and so are we. But every passerby gives a nod to me. Marching in the downpour and some complain. I'm warmed by the knowledge we are the same. No, you're not alone.